the following chart might help explain it better, as well as answer the previous question. Penny doubled every day for a month. Day 1, 1 cent. Day 2, 2 cents. Day 3, 4 cents. Day 4, 8 cents. Day 5, 16 cents. Day 6, 32 cents. Day 7, 64 cents. Day 8, $1.28. Day 9, $2.56. Day 10, $5.12. Day 11, $10.24. Day 12, $20.48. Day 13, $40.96. Day 14, $81.92. Day 15, $163.84. Day 16, $327.68. Day 17, $655.36. Day 18, $1,310.72. Day 19, $2,621.44. Day 20, $5,242.88. Day 21, $10,485.76. Day 22, $20,971.52. Day 23, $41,943.04. Day 24, $83,886.08. Day 25, $167,772.16. Day 26, $335,544.32. Day 27, $671,088.64. Day 28, $1,342,177.28. $1,342,177.28. Day 29, $2,684,354.56. Day 30, $5,368,709.12. Day 31, $10,737,418.24. So, if you answered a million right now, that is the answer most people would give. But as you can see a little patience and around day 28 you get your million and then some. In fact, if you are in a 31 day month you will have close to 11 million dollars. My life's quest was to figure out how to take that little chart and replicate it in the investment world. To apply the simple math of compounding with very little money invested that would become millions in not only my lifetime but in less than a decade. So on we go into understanding the not so complicated world of the stock market. Trust me, it is simpler than you may think. In Burton Malkiel's book, A Random Walk Down Wall Street, he said that a blind folded monkey throwing darts at a newspaper's financial page could select a portfolio that would do just as well as one carefully selected by an expert. Burton was a professor of economics at Princeton University. I am not suggesting you open the newspaper up, who reads those nowadays anyway? And start randomly start picking stocks to purchase, but researching with some discipline. I will get deeper into the research part later and I have developed a smart app called Stock Stats to help. But if anyone ever tells you they are a great stock picker, run the opposite way. I pride myself in researching companies that issue shares of stocks. Not being a stock picker. I'm a stock researcher and investor.